بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم آئی ایم ڈاکٹر آفتاب علی آئی ایم اے چائلڈ اسپیشلسٹ ان پاکستان آئی کلیئر مائی ایم آر سی پی سی ایچ پارٹ ون ایگزام ڈیٹ از ایف او پی اینڈ ٹاس ایگزامس دس از مائی فرسٹ ویڈیو آئی میڈ دس ویڈیو فار دا فریشرس ہو آر گوئنگ ٹو اسٹارٹ پریپریشن فار دا ایم آر سی پی سی ایچ ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول ڈسکس اباؤٹ ہاؤ ٹو اپلائی فار دا تھیوری ایگزامس آف ایم آر سی پی سی ایچ how to make your account how to register and <clears throat> first of all what is the full form of mrcpch so basically rcpch is a college royal college of pediatrics and child health while mrcpch is a degree which rcpch is providing which is member of royal college of pediatrics and child health so basically there are four exams to complete the degree of mrcpch three three are theory exams and one is clinical so in part 1 fop which is known as foundation of practice and theory and science these both exams are in part 1 and part 2 applied knowledge of practice these three exams are theory exams and last one is clinical exam <clears throat> theory exams are computer based exams you would take them at a test center or online in evaluation at your own place theory exams can be taken in any orders no sequence is required you can give them you can give apna knowledge of practice first means part 2 exam first you can give task exam first it's your own wish and depend it's on your knowledge and experience experience if you have good experience you are pg student you can give up the knowledge of practice initially if you are just passing the mbbs you are fresher so start with the fop or tas exam or you can give both exam together for clinical exam you must have to pass the theory exam it's compulsory so it was a basic knowledge about exam first of all you have to open an account in rcpch website so how will you open uh, your account in rcpch website first of all open site of rcpch link is given in description click on these three lines which are visible in this image like this then go to the, go to this register after that this website will appear registered with us then you have to fill the whole form then upload your mbbs degree nic or passport and your picture then submit the form then next you have to register for your exam so how will you that now log in into your account go to my account some same clicking by three lines in the right upper side of the screen then there will then you have to register for exam you will need to register for your exam account at least 10 working days before the application application period is open so what is application period i will tell you in next slide once you get registered they will send you a confirmatory email with rcpch number so next uh, what are the dates of exams and uh, what is application period so fop and tasks which combinedly known as part 1 exams both held on the same day fop in the morning while tasks in the evening fop tasks exams can held um, fop and tasks exams held in february june and october apply knowledge of practice which is also known as part 2 held in january may and september booking period is a time in which booking window is open for 1 to 2 week you can apply for exams only in this window it usually open 2 month before the exams so test delivery means the test center exam takes place in the centers test centers across the uk and other countries and online exams at your own place so you have two options either you go to the centers or you choose your place as a online invigilation system application are are on first come first serve basis 
they have limited seats so you have to be smart to book in time test center or via ngh delivery in these countries like uh, uk ireland europe egypt sudan uae saudi arabia qatar and middle east and north africa pakistan hong kong nepal india sri lanka in south asia and far east so basically these are the centers what is examination time and when it start when it ends this all depend on your time zone in this slides its time is a uk time and ireland time fop exam basically starts at 9:30 in the morning and ends 12 in the afternoon tas exam starts 2 o'clock to 4:30 in the evening both paper on same day you have choice to give both paper together or separately this is the choice in part 1 exam either you give separately both exam or give together same for applied knowledge of practice applied knowledge of practice uh, also have two paper but you have, must have to give together both papers paper 1 in the morning paper 2 is in evening so for your countries they will send you a admit card in which there is a written that uh, your time zone is written in that so what is the course of mrcp theory exams if you give fop and task exam separately it will cost 335 to 415 australian pound if you give both exams together so you have a choice here you can save some money 565 to 690 sterling sterling pound for applied knowledge it is 565 to 795 in pakistan uh, it's almost uh, 195000 rupees for applied knowledge and for um, fop and uh, tas separately it's almost 90000 in pakistan pakistani rupees so basically how will you apply when the when the application period or booking period is open then uh, you have to be smart enough because it is very crucial period limited seat everyone is applying you have to hurry in a smart way it is all online system you should already log in into your account you can apply only the application period which always open at 9:30 UK time in the morning so you have to check your time zones before in pakistan uh, it's 1:30 pm in summer and 2:30 pm in the winter as uk is 4 hours behind us a recommended browser is google chrome so you have to download the google chrome and so what is the procedure now come to the procedure first of all you uh, you log in into the into your account then go to the exam panel there uh, there some link will be given for for apply uh, when you cl click on that links so your exam dashboard will appear that exam dashboard shows your progress if you already given any exam pass or fail it will show your progress it also shows exams in which you may apply in future you select the exam Uh, FOP or TAS or both together. Our apply knowledge practice and select method method either center or online and the location in which you wish to sit for your exam. Now, next, when you select your preferred exam, then your seat reserved only for 10 minutes in which you have to complete your payment and fill the application form. you will need to pay via debit or credit card so uh, you have to call your bank that you want to uh, do the international transaction your exam booking will be confirmed only after successful payment after payment you will receive an email to confirm your place okay so any candidate would would who withdraw the application during the application window so he is entitled 
to a hundred percent referral he will get a hundred percent referral they do not provide refund for withdrawals after the application window is closed except in some exceptional circumstances if you believe if you believe you have a reasons to receive a partial refund due to exceptional circumstances please include evidence at the point of requesting a withdraw if you did not give exam to any reason then you can apply for partial refund as uh, partial refund in the exceptional circumstances known as post examination refund but you have to give the proof that there is an exceptional circumstance what to do before the exam day as your preparation is almost done you have uh, read studied all the books of the required uh, required part now it's time to solve the sample paper which is available in rcpch website link is given in the description these are important because you will become familiar with the format of exam and the software of the exam and there is a chance maybe one or two questions from the sample paper come in exams okay now what is to expect on the exam day bring admission document the document they will send send you through email about 3 to 4 week 3 to 4 weeks before the exam day so you have to print that paper and bring any of the following id passport valid driving license or national id card if you experience any technical difficulty on the day please seek the support of the support of your invigilator which is available on the that website so what will uh, do after the exams you have to wait for exam result which is available about 5 to 6 weeks after your exam if you work in the uk you may have up to 6 attempts to pass each of the exams for the rcpch there is no restriction for candidates working working permanent in other countries so this is the contact email and contact number of uh, rcpch you can contact them for any difficulties so thank you all i hope you like my video kindly subscribe my channel encourage my effort so it was my first video my next video will be on how to study for part 1 mrcp ch exam uh, i am very thankful to my friends and family especially dr afraz and dr fatma who encouraged to make a youtube channel so uh, thank you